Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Starting off with 7.2.3, today will be buffet, heal, reversal, and safeguard. So with buffet, every time there is a buff activated on the attacker, it's immediately nullified and 10% bar of power, 10% uh, HP is given to the defender. As well as safeguard, the opponent cannot lose more than 1% of their HP from any source, which is a bit redundant here because their HP pools are so high that it doesn't really matter. And also there is heal reversal, so any region on you or the opponent is going to be heal reversed. So if you are running willpower, you have to remove it from here because if you are running willpower, that will be all reversed and you will be taking damage throughout the fight. And the last one is aspect of war, so your block proficiency decreases from 0 to 50, uh, 0 to 100 in 50 seconds. So you can try to bring down the champions in 50 seconds. So use champions that have power gain that can easily navigate through that without uh, hit without getting hit by the opponent and playing no parry style. Some of the best options are going to be your petrified champs that will finish this fight really quick or champions that gain a lot of buffs because they can be nullified and with the buffet they, they will give regen to the opponent and with the heal reversal they will lose health. But despair 3x3 will help you a lot here so try to have that and the bosses we're going to tackle is going to be a hit monkey so stay tuned guys not really a difficult path but it's a really fun one with really good rewards at the end of it before we jump into the path guys make sure to like the video subscribe to the channel and turn on those post notifications and leave a comment down below all of that really helps me out a lot now the first fight is going to be against a winter soldier now five out of six defenders on this path are going to be metal so if you bring in magneto you can easily kill them off so i am just going to showcase with magneto so you will notice i used the dexterity that caused uh, the buffet to trigger and because of that and heal reversal winter soldier lost some health right there so in easy way all you need to do is parry heavy and build up to an sp3 and in the meanwhile when the buffet timer is active is ready just dex or use any uh, buff on yourself that will try to give 10 percent hp to the defender and with the heal reversal he will take damage so yeah guys just build up to an sp3 use that just make sure you do it fast because after 50 seconds he goes unblockable and also unstoppable after using special so you just need to be careful about it and finish the fight as quickly as possible even though if he goes unblockable after 50 seconds you can always just stay away and just use dexterity to trigger that buffet and that heal reversal and you can kill off defenders so it becomes a little difficult a little technical to fight after 50 seconds but it's not the hardest thing in the world you can just have to swipe back when he tries to hit you and trigger your dexterity that will trigger the buffet and because of that heal reversal and that will give damage to the opponent and you can kill him off like that as well Next up is going to be an Omega Red and now he is also a metal champion so you can use Magneto as well. On this fight I'm going to use Hyperion so this is a showcase of champions that have a lot of buffs that work really well here. So all you need to do is to parry and heavy and try to trigger more buffs. As soon as the buffet goes off cooldown and you gain a, and you gain a Fury on Hyperion that Fury is nullified and the heal reversal is there and that gives damage to omega red you will notice it's already down to half health and i have just done and barely done anything to him you can still throw your specials if you like and give him damage but junk of your damage will come from the buffet and heal reversal so yes guys all you need to do is to parry and heavy and keep gaining those furies and whenever the buffet timer is up it's ready it will nullify one of those furies and give damage at, from heal reversal to the opponent and he will die very quick you can essentially run the whole path with hyperion with the same strategy
Now the next fight is going to be against Doctor Strange. Now, like Doc Ock will is not the champion that has easy access to buffs, and he will not be triggering the heal reversal. But I like playing Doc Ock against all of these power gain champions, like for example Sorcerer Supreme, Doctor Strange, because you can just take them in the corner and use your heavy attacks and really power lock them, and they can do nothing. And with your all of those researches going to 100 they will give extra damage so this is my way of dealing with them just take them to a corner once you have a power lock and just keep spamming your heavy that will reactivate the power lock and you can easily kill them off like that but the more practical and more easier way is to bring in a champion with petrify that will control their power and also double up on the heal reversal plus despair so that will kill them off faster i will explain more about it in on the iron man infinity war fight to stay tuned this is just a fun little thing i like to do whenever there is doctor strange or any champion that has just a regular power gain that doesn't depend on hits or anything Next up is going to be a yellow jacket. Now with him also very regulation yellow jacket fight, nothing too difficult about it. I am just using a mole man here because I love using mole man. So all I'm going to do is to build up with my, uh, with those uh, charges and then keep hitting into him. Bait his SP1 out and that's about it because the damage bleeds and the criticals are so high that he will die before the 50 second mark uh, before the 50 second mark bef uh, before he goes unblockable so yes guys you can bring in any champion and that occasional dex will also trigger the buffet and that will also give you a reversal so that will bring down the opponent really quick nothing too difficult about this fight he's also a metal champion yellow jacket so you can still use magneto here Next up is going to be a sp star Spider-Man Stark Enhanced. Now with him, you just need to be careful about a couple of things. One is going to be his heavy attack with that big power drain. And secondly, also his evasion that can trigger a lot here. I would suggest you to bring in a Cosmic Champion because that will be the best way to deal with him. You don't have to use a heavy specifically to... Uh, turn off his AI so in my case I'm gonna use a Hyperion because I will also gain a lot of buffs with the heavy and that buffs will trigger buffet and because of buffet the heal reversal will give damage to St Spider-Man Stark Enhanced so you can do it go on the same route otherwise Petrified Champs also work also heal reversal champ like Guillotine will work and also he's a metal champion so Magneto will work as well so it's upon you what choice you take it's a pretty straightforward and fun path and easy fight And the final fight before the boss is going to be an Iron Man Infinity War. Now I'm going to use a Void here. Now my Void is unduped, you can still use him, but for that you will need 3x3 three three Despair Mastery or um, you can have a duped Void. So the whole concept is get those Petrify buffs on him and then you can easily just dex it out. So not only he will get damage from the Heal Reversal node, he will also get more damage because of Petrify on him. And if you're running Despair Mastery, there will be further more a heal reversal so void is like a real M mvp for all of this part so if you have a dupe void he can just solo the whole path and take you till the boss very easily you will notice now there are two petrify buffs on him plus i also have three by three despair and plus there is heal reversal so you will notice how much health he loses when only one uh, dex or one buffet trigger right there he's on 27 percent health and i think on the next trigger he will lose all of his health and he will die yeah just right there
Now the final fight and that is the boss that is going to be against a hit monkey. Now this hit monkey has life cycle on him and also no hit mercy. So with no hit mercy whenever you knock down he will gain a cruelty buff, buff and he also has a heavy assault. And he's immune to shock so you cannot use doom here and do corner slaps. So the whole concept is that you parry him and you use your heavy and with that heavy assault he gets extra damage. But with hit monkey his ability is whenever you knock him down he will get those raised charges on him and he can shrug up buffs very quick and also he can do a lot of damage. So the best way to deal with it is to knock him down and then just stay back and run out the timer on the senses cunning and then you can go back in and kill him and also the primal rage so you have to manage both of them and that's about it guys any parry heavy cell champion would work we are taking him out with an archangel here and stacking those neuro poisons next up we will in the next video we will take him out with a, a colossus with omega red so stay tuned for that as well guys and yes guys pretty easy and straightforward boss one of the easier ones so i hope you enjoyed the video and you enjoyed the tips and tricks it was a quick 10 minute path but with great rewards at the end of it if you enjoyed it guys make sure to like the video subscribe to the channel and turn on those post notifications all of that really helps me out a lot and helps me grow the channel and apart from that guys i hope you all have an amazing day and i'll see you next time